I will show you how to add a low thermoplastic splint to a simple leg wrap and transform it into a custom made carpal brace for your dog. At normal temperature, the splint is rigid. Use any oven dish. One that is large enough to contain the size of the sheet. Pour hot water into it. And soak the sheet for 2-3 to three minutes. The temperature must be at least 71 Celsius degrees. If you use boiling water, be careful not to burn yourself. Select a form of soft protection such as a sock. It will be placed between the sheet and the patient's skin. Place the sock around the wrist. Be careful to leave no folds in the area where you wish to mold the splint. Withdraw the sheet from the hot water. Be careful with heat. You may use some tool to remove it. As you can see, the sheet is soft and its temperature is not as high as the temperature of the water. You can touch it with your fingers. Hurry, as you only have a few minutes to apply to the patient, before it starts to harden again. Place the soft sheet around the wrist, in the area where the dog needs support. Massage the area and shape the splint to the shape of the leg. You feel some warmth from the splint. The patient will also feel it. As it is not too hot for your hand, it should not be too hot for the patient either. Hold it in place tight for several minutes until the splint becomes hard again. Remove the splints gently. Sometimes the fabric may stick to it. Gently remove it. As you can see, it is the exact contour and shape of the patient's leg. Now, you can use a leg wrap to hold the splint. Place the tailored made splint above the wrap, to make it comfortable, against the skin. Then close the straps above the splint, to hold it in place. You can take the time to smooth the corners and the edges. Use scissors to cut the corners. Then a heat gun, or hot water, to soften the edges, and rub them to become smooth. The splints can be reheated and used again a few times. but some areas may become thinner and stretch. 